The South Carolina Environmental Law Project is hosting the ninth annual Wildside Fundraiser in Georgetown. And in studio this morning, we have Amy Armstrong to tell us all about it. Amy, talk to me about the Wildside event. What is this sure. event all about? Sure. Thanks so much for having us, Chrissy. Um, the event is really it was started um, nine years ago as a way to celebrate the legacy of Jimmy Chandler, who started the Environmental Law Project 31 years ago. And he he died, unfortunately, when he was 60, really, really too early. But in those years, he had achieved much in, as far as environmental conservation and protection for the state. And so it's really a way for friends to come together to celebrate all of the work that Jimmy has done and that we're continuing to do and carry on um, his legacy. And so that's why we started the event. And it's really become critical to um, supporting our ability to, to um, continue the work. So this event, open to the public. Mm -hmm. You're encouraging as many people to come as possible, right? So right. how can people attend your event? So they can register online at, uh, at scalp.org um, and buy tickets there. We, um, this year is really exciting because we had some important successes this year in protecting sea turtles. Uh, we had an Endangered Species Act case that um, sought to remove walls, plastic sea walls, from oh, wow. the beach at Isle of Palms, that they were interfering with mama sea turtle nests. And so we were successful in having those walls removed. And in order to really celebrate that success, we invited Mary Alice Monroe to be our guest speaker. And she really popularized the plight of sea turtles through her Beach House um, book series. And she really has we've got some alignment with her because she really wants to inspire people to care about the resource because when people care then they act and so we want to do the same thing we want people to care about the work that we're doing which is about protecting what we all love and, and is so special about South Carolina and the low country and our environment and so um, we also want people to act come to the event celebrate with us um, overlooking Winyah Bay it's a, a beautiful evening so real quick, the event November 3rd, what time and where exactly is it? So it's from 5 to 8. It's at Hobcaw Barony, which is the site of a National Estuarine Research Reserve. It's overlooking Winyah Bay. There's dolphins in the background, um, eagles flying overhead, and it's a really special evening. Excellent. Well, thanks for being with us this morning, Amy. Thank you. We're headed to break. We'll be right back.